our third date um, now. And, uh, oh, look at this. Jazz give it a fix. journey and what we're loving about this uh, the whole upfront thing but also just getting to be a little bit um, more personal I guess with with um, with you know our friends and we like to call it our tribe you know around the world is that uh, it's just it just helps us to kind of um, reiterate what this is all about for us and that's just empowering people wherever they are to draw closer to God in their everyday walk um, understanding that we're all a part of something bigger than ourselves and I love that you know if, you know, we had like 150 uh, people at the meet and greet in Seattle, and it was awesome. And then in Portland as well, and there's you guys, and tomorrow night we're in LA. And, and I, I know there's going to be a lot of people there, but there's this sense of we're a part of something awesome, a, a, a team, you know. And, and we've always thought about that the way we do things with um, when it comes to worship. You know, the last thing we've ever wanted to do is, is, uh, is to be rock stars, you know. It's just not worth it for us. But we love being able to come and to, to kind of just give everything we have to God, to use the best of our gifts. Whatever that is, if it you know, looks like playing drums or if it's, you know, some of our team here who are, you know, brilliant at just like plugging in guitars and tuning them or like fixing broken stages. We, we snapped our entire stage in half the other night and our production team spent, they didn't sleep for like 36 hours and just like we're working on it like crazy to get it done and, um, and fortunately they pulled it off. But I just love that the collaborative nature of the kingdom of God. That's what Zion's all about. You know, it's a sense of, hey, we're all a part of something. We all have a part to play. You have a part to play. You know, whether you're in you know, high school or you're in university or you're studying, you don't even know what you want to do with your life yet. God's still got a specific plan and purpose for you now, here, wherever you might be, you know. And we have this, you know, in, in New York City, we, we kind of talk about uh, occupying all streets. Hmm. This idea of just, you know, wherever you find yourself. I can't be in, you know, Sacramento or in San Francisco Woo! or in Concord Woo! or wherever you might be from. You know, I, I live in New York and these guys live in Sydney, but... You know, if we all just take responsibility for where God's placed us, where God's positioned us, what God's called us to, it's amazing what we can be a part of together, amen? Amen. Yeah. amen. So, it's Chad. He's going to say something. Chad? Woo! Yeah. Woo! All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, always, I always ask Robert to do that. So. Um, you know what? I just love that you guys um, that you guys get to have a bit of a glimpse inside kind of our little crew because the last thing like John said the last thing we want you guys to think is that we're just touring around putting on these events when pretty much it's only maybe two or two and a half months a year we get to do it the rest of the time we're kind of we're sowing and we're committed in, and planted in our home churches and hopefully through Upfront you'd get to see a bit of a glimpse of that because actually that's that's what um, afforded us the kind of the opportunity to do what we're doing right now and that is just sowing into our youth ministries and our creative teams and being at church on Sundays and you know just really wanting um, just to be available for God to use us however that would be like Joel said everyone plays a part and I just really um, I'm really pumped because I, I, I'm glad that, that you can maybe you'd, you'd get a window into um, what is not a rock band or a, a Christian mm -hmm. So celebrity group or whatever. Um, <laughs> but but you would get a glimpse into actually um, what you know what we're really kind of the message behind what is Hillsong United and what is Hillsong, yeah. and that is we um, we just want people to meet with God and we want the church the, the church of Jesus Christ to grow. Yeah. And so um, if we can encourage you in any way, I pray it would be that. Awesome. And so um, thanks so much for coming. Yeah. Thanks so much. You are Thank you. So we have a little tiny bit of time, so we'll try and say hi and just um, yeah. yeah. Hey guys, I'm I'm Sean.